Good morning, to lads. My name is General Bluebell, and welcome back to Crooked Man. What the fuck did we do last time? I don't know. I don't know. I think we were. Whoops, my mouse is on the screen. Uh, we were visiting our mother in the hospital. I think. Uh, what? An empty trash can. Mm, riveting. All right. Mm. An old computer. Hmm. Not many clothes inside. Uh, did they move this chair? Hmm. There's something in a drawer. Got a leaf leaflet for a school. Which one? I don't know. Looks pretty old. Hmm. These LLM courses are circled. Was somebody shooting to be a lawyer? Well, there goes my question. Okay. I guess this must be the former tenant. He sure forgot a bunch of stuff. Maybe no furniture is better after all, huh? Um, uh, you're good, David. You're awesome! Okay, let's check where... Oh, the stupid phone! Hello? Hey David, what are you doing? Or how are you doing? Whoops. Can you just say how you I mean... Ha, huh, you saw me just yesterday. I'm doing fine, thanks. Good, good. Call if you are ever lonely, okay? That is so sweet. <laughs> By the way, I got a call from Shirley yesterday. We didn't really talk, but... Sorry! I told her your number. She said she was so worried about you. It's okay. Tell her that I don't I don't need her worry. She should just look out after for herself. All right. Well, I'll hang up now. All right. See you. Who the hell says I'll hang up now? <laughs> I don't know. Dots. David says dots. Nice. Oh, coffee! I'm tired of reading. I should go to bed. What were you reading? Were you re reading uh, Misery by Stephen King? That's an old book. But it's so goddamn good. I read it like three times. I'm sorry. Uh, the telly! Television! Shut the hell up, will you? Why did it turn on by itself? Is it broken? Uh, probably. Sink! Oh god. GAH! <laughs> what? That's... This is creepy. Did it say sink? What... What was that? Uh, that... What was sink? I think it's not in, like, trend anymore. <laughs> hmm, there's a scrap of paper under here. Got a scrap of paper. There was a crooked man, and he walked a crooked mile. He found a crooked sixpence against a crooked style. He brought a he bought a crooked cat, which got a crooked mouse, and they all lived together in a little crooked house. Isn't this a mother goose rhyme? Why is this here under the sink? I guess this is previous tenants. Ah, hey, that's cool. This is so strange. I should sleep and forget about it. All of his worries are like, I'll just go to bed. He's gonna sleep all of his worries away. Jeez. Moving for a change of pace, huh? Yes, that's not working so well. I appreciate Paul and Marion's help, but... But what? That's a kid's crying. Is there a kid out here? What what kid would live in these beat up apartments? Heck, maybe they're lost. I should go check. Okay, we're checking for a lost kid. Cutscene. <laughs> 
course there is no kids here. You must be getting tired. Well then go back to bed. There was a smashy glass sound. Probably cough cough. Like a mug? Yup, there's a mug. This broken cup. Jeez, that startled me. Wait, what? Help me. The coffee says, a poor coffee. I cannot help you now. You gotta be... This room is really, really strange. With its voices and TV turning on. What is this? A broken mug? An apartment? A uh, weird television? I don't know. Uh, hi Paul, it's David. Uh, yeah, what's up? Man, you sound sleepy, haha. Ha ha ha. Um... I was up all night. All last night. Yes. I gotta ask you something. Is now okay? Yeah. What? Do you know who used to live in this room? Nah, I don't know. Uh, you asked the landlady? Landlady. I don't know what the hell is wrong with me today. You're curious about something. Well, seems like he forgot a lot of stuff. But I'll ask the landlady. Sure, later. Bye. The, la the landlady's floor. No, wait. Is on the far end of the first floor. I should go and see what she knows. I don't know. She knows. She probably should know where the hell, um, what the, what was the previous tenant up to in his uh, beat up old room, far end of the first floor. There we go. Hello. Oh, it's Mr. David. What seems to be the matter? Good day, miss. I just want to ask you something, you see. About the room, I mean. Can you tell me anything about the person who used to live there? Hmm, well, you know, these apartments have always people come and going, coming and going. Now, what was that boy's name? I believe he was a man about your age. He suddenly left about a month ago. S said to leave the few furniture and use it, however. You wouldn't know where he went. I never heard no. Really, just up and left out of the blue. Ah. I can't remember that name. I could rummage through my documents and to find the previous talents if you'd like. No, there's no need. I was just a little curious. Thank you. Thanks. I'll see you around. Alrighty. Sorry I wasn't very useful. That's a nice landlady, actually. <laughs> if only landladies were that nice in real life. Well, I guess. I guess some, de some are. A man about my age. I could only wonder. Oh well, I'll go back to my room. Okay, we're going back to our room apparently. Okay, so... Hello, Planty. I hate you. But I like you as well, what the hell. Somebody's been here. And there's a crack in the wall. And there are footsteps from the uh, crack on the wall. No, stop checking on the TV. I know it's sexy TV, but it's not a, that. It's an old TV. Well, why are these tracks on the floor? They lead up to this wall. Is there something in this crack? Got a brass key. This key is pretty fancy. I doubt it's for anything in here. So I wonder where. I 
that. The guy's voice, the kid's voice, the mirror writing, the TV turning on, the coffee. Huh, it's like pol poltergeist in or something. Oh yeah, it does sound like ghosts. But I wonder, have I thought the landlady would mention this kind of thing? What's going on here? Um, I don't know, you got a pretty shit room, <laughs> I guess. Not that I care if there were any ghosts here. I wouldn't much care if they haunted me or killed me either. Jesus, David, that's pretty dark. <laughs> but I wonder about that scrap of paper. But I want. Oh, wait. What was the man who lived here like? Did this stuff happen when he was here? Not much just thinking about it. I'll call it a day. Okay. Go back to your bed, David. What the fuck was that? Well, what? Why? Why? Where is that coming from? Is it from inside the house? I don't know. What? It could only be in the room. I mean... Aha! Uh -huh. It's coming from in here! Radio? What's... Why is this in the closet? Not to mention turning on by itself. Hmm, there's something on this paper here. It's an address? Our special place. What's that supposed to be? What a paper with an address? Um, um, what? what? No, 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 no. Okay. I'm I'm waiting for you. Who? What? I'm I'm waiting for you. Wh what? Why? Did? How? And when it did? Who? Ah! That's spooky. That's very spooky. So, you sleep well last night. Sorry, I... You had to sleep on the couch. Nah, no, I should be sorry for coming over so late. Huh, wasn't expecting it. But don't sweat it. But hey, did something happen? You don't look so too hot. Oh, there's no, no particular reason. Or maybe I felt like intruding the newlyweds. Love nest. Okay, whatever. Hey, why are you? Ha 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 ha. I'm just kidding. Seriously though. You can tell me if anything happens, okay? I'll do whatever I can for you. That's a nice friend actually. Alright, heh. I'm glad to have a buddy who looks out for his friends. That is so sweet. Hey, you making fun of me? No. Oh yeah, I heard from Marion. Sorry about the shillerly thing. I told her off for that. Don't worry about it, it's not Marion's fault. Well, it's not about whose fault it is. I'm just so not happy about it. Don't let it get you down, alright? I know you got your mother to look after, but I think it's time you move on and... and look for new people. Great. As if a guy could me could, could ever find a date. Don't be like that. Please. I'm just some clerk with a mom in a hospital. And the girl I wanted to marry ran, ran away from me. Man. Don't be such a sissy. You'll keep up that moping and you'll have your own personal rain cloud. 
I'd love that. It's a, a, a cloud. Wow. Huh. Well, I'll be careful. Okay. Oh, I'm going to go for a little trip. Don't want to waste my vacation, you know. Ooh, great idea. Where are you going? Just somewhere I was wondering about. I'll call you when I get there. Sweet. Send the postcard. Breakfast ready, Paul. David, will you be eating too? No, I'm not hungry. I'll be going. Aw, that's too bad. Come by any time you like. That is so sweet. These people are very sweet. Okay. There. Looks like this address is in the mountains. About a five hour drive. Did the former tenant go there? I just want to ask him about this room. Maybe he'll know something. Hell, I'll go right now. I can't stand this place anyway. Jesus. The hell is happening? I don't know. Prologue. David's room. And Oh, and I think I leave it here. I like this game. It's a, good, it's, a, it's, a it's a little game and also when was the last time I played this? I don't even remember. I'll save it on data 3. Good. And yeah, but I leave this off. Here. You know. But yeah, like and subscribe and share and favorite and all that kind of nice stuff. And keep on marching brilliant to victory. And I'll see you all in the next video!